Hi everyone, uh, Michelle here. It's Sunday. Um, I wanted to start a new video series called Small Shop Sunday, where um, when I have purchased from a small shop in our crafting community, uh, I will post um, a video sharing, um, you know, a haul from their shop. Um, a lot of people are doing hauls. Um, I generally don't do big hauls like a Joann's or a Michael's because there's lots of us that do that already. Um, but I really wanted to feature small businesses um, on my Small Shop Sunday. So um, these are, most of these businesses are, um, you know, working out of their home, um, in a garage, you know, craft room, whatever, making really fun things for um, the crafting community. So I wanted to give a shout out to those people and start featuring them um, whenever I purchase. So it won't be every Sunday because I don't, you know, shop all the time but whenever i do i'll definitely um, do a video and share it with you guys on sunday so um let's to get started for today this one is um uh, her name is shadney and you can find her on instagram at at shadney and it's s-h-a-d-n-e-e -E. so i'll show you that close up here so that's her on instagram and then um her etsy shop is um, shadney.etsy.com. So definitely go check her out. Um, follow her on Instagram so you can see her latest products. And um, uh, this is not a um, sponsored post. I didn't receive this stuff for free from her. I actually saw these um, little epoxy dots here and um, went on her site and started following her, ordered, ordered these, and then I found some Christmas stuff since Halloween was over. So these will um, just get put away till next year, and then I'll use all my good my good Christmas stuff. But um, she calls these epoxy sprinkles, and they aren't actually, they are not a sticker. So um, you will either glue them to your project, or um, you these are thin enough, you could actually add them in a shaker with some additional sequins and stuff, which I think would be super, super cute. Um, so I think I'll try that next year, and then of course glue them to project projects. But um, I absolutely am obsessed with candy corns when I craft for Halloween. And um, I liked that this was kind of a little twist on that. So um, really, 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 really like these. And um, yeah, they're super, super good quality. So, and you get quite a few. Um, this is all from one um, bag. So I ordered three of those for next year. And then um, this here um, these are also epoxy dots and she has glued them on a, um, it's like a button. It's a wooden, let me show the back of that. So it's actually a wooden button. And then the inside, um, you know, fits this little epoxy, um, uh, snowflake. Really, really cute. So let me show you those close up. And I love this mix because, um, it had some non-traditional Christmas colors. So, I craft with both traditional and non, and I um, I love to add like a little pop of blue or pink or something um, when I'm crafting. So, yeah. So that's those there, and like I said, she's very generous in her packages. Um, I don't remember. Let me see if I have on my receipt what if it tells what I paid. Okay, so I'll just tell you just. Just to give you an idea, I feel like it's super, super reasonable. So this is three seventy five dollars um, for that, those candy corns. And you get, looks like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, ten. So you get ten in a pack. So very reasonable. Um, the These here were four seventy five, dollars but again, you get quite a few. And then I did one wreath set, and um, the, that was $6. And these are actual wood veneers and that she's laser cut. And then um, you get six wreaths and then you get, aren't those bows so cute? Oh my gosh, so adorable. So yeah, I thought this would be really, really fun. And you could definitely leave this just, you know, the wood color or you could, you know, color it in or paint it in if you wanted. So I think I might try painting a couple, um, probably not the wreath, but maybe the bow, I think would be kind of cute, but yeah, definitely um a really fun for Christmas and then as a thank you for shopping with her she sent me this little truck isn't that adorable like look how look at the detail on that so cute and then the little uh pumpkin cluster and then the little sign so I'm I'm gonna put that with my um Halloween uh crafty stuff and use that next year so 
uh, anyway, yeah, thanks for stopping by. Just a really quick haul, and I will um, feature someone um, possibly in the next you know week or two um, when I have another uh, small business purchase. All right, have a great week. Uh, re ah, have a great rest of your weekend. Thanks. Bye.